Never one to shy away from controversy, Republican Congressman Stephen King of Iowa appeared on G. Gordon Liddy's radio program. The topic was illegal immigration. That's when the congressman said this. The president has demonstrated he's got a default mechanism of him that breaks down the side of race, on, on the side of uh, it, it favors the black person. NBC's Luke Russert is live on Capitol Hill. Luke, are people talking about this there? Uh, yes, and it, it is quite interesting, Chris. Uh, both sides have told me uh, privately that Mr. King is, is, is not something that's really shocking from him, that he is someone that likes to say things that are already absurd, and this is just another long line of hits that he has said uh, over his career. Keep in mind, this is the gentleman that said voting for health care reform on a Sunday was an affront to God. He also said that if Mr. Obama were to be elected president, the terrorists would, quote, dance in the streets. Also yesterday, he's been perpetuating this idea that Barack Obama's half aunt, uh, a woman named Miss Oyango from Kenya, should testify before Congress because of the recent asylum she was granted since she's been here in, since 2000. So Republicans and Democrats have both told me that this is nothing shocking for Mr. King. They expect this out of him. Uh, one antidote I can provide was during the health care run-up, there was a Tea Party protest, and there was a sign that said, Kenya, trust Obama, K-E-N hyphen Y-A. There was a congressman who was the first to autograph that sign. That was Mr. King. So no one, no, never one to shy away from controversy. How does this play out politically? Well, he was scheduled to speak at a fundraiser in Colorado for a Mr. Cory Gardner, a Republican running for Congress there, uh, who has been got a lot of support from the Tea Party. That fundraiser has been abruptly canceled. Uh, Mr. King will not be speaking on his on, uh, on, for Mr. Gardner. And Democrats are telling me uh, that privately they would like this controversy a lot. They can cast against Republicans as being extreme and way out of touch with mainstream American ideas. Chris? All right. You certainly have had your share of uh, interesting stories over the last couple of days, Luke. Thanks. Only in America. <laughs> Take care.